What I love, Wallahi, when you hear stories like this of people and they put great effort. I love the story of one of the early Muslims and he was praying at night and he prayed for a long time and then his legs hurt him. So he sat down after the taslim, he sat down. Then he looked at his legs and he had a stick in his hand. So he took it and he hit his legs, almost like a punishment for them. He hit his legs. He said, do the Prophet's companions think they're going to surpass us by far? You understand what he means? He means the, the companions are way ahead of us, right? So he said, how big are we going to allow this gap to be? He says, Wallahi, we're going to لَنُزَاحِمَنَّهُمْ عَلَيْهِ We're going to, basically, it's kind of like we're going to compete or give them, give them a run for their money. And he, the gap is huge, but we're going to make it a little less huge. So then he hit his legs with the stick and said, I'm going to get up and I'm going to pray. So I love it because he was human and he found it difficult. And then he told himself, you know what? They were human and the gap between us and them is huge, but I'm going to force myself. So yeah, it hurts sometimes, but you force yourself. Sometimes you want to keep going and your body gives up, but you force yourself. And that's what's so wonderful about the narration. Yes, we're going to try. We're going to try to compete with them. فاستبقوا الخيرات أينما تكونوا يأتي بكم الله جميعا إن الله على كل شيء قدير